one. And lift off of Discovery. Hello everyone, welcome back to the Filmstock YouTube channel. We are Chris and Christina and we are here to help you make better videos and empower your inner video creator. If you've ever wanted to add an animated countdown to your videos, then the Big Metal Countdown Pack from Filmstock will help you do that. It could be a top 10 cute cats countdown, it could be a top 3 tips video, or it could be the top 5 supercars in the world. This pack will work for all of those types of videos. To make sure you don't miss out on any future video tips, make sure you hit the subscribe button down below. This pack is a pretty easy one, but let's jump into Filmora 11 and Chris is going to show you a few examples of how you can use it. So now that we're in Filmora 11, you will need to download the Big Metal Countdown Pack. The link for that is in the description. Once you have it downloaded, if you click on Elements up here and then scroll all the way down to the bottom until you see Filmstock and click that, you will see all the effects that you've downloaded in here. And here is the Big Metal Countdown. In this pack there are three different types of countdowns as you would have seen at the start of this video and for this first one I'm going to use this gold countdown right here because I think it just fits the theme a little better. So for this first example imagine it's a top 10 cute cats countdown video. I have my three clips of my three different cats and I'm just going to show you how you could use the countdowns to create something like I showed you at the start. So this is pretty quick and simple I'm just going to drag number five down in front of the first cat right here and I'm actually going to use a transition between the number five and the cat just to blend things together nicely. I think this one will work quite well because the colors are quite similar but I am going to make it a little bit shorter so we have something like that I think looks quite good and because the clip of the cat is quite still I'm just going to use a little bit of keyframing just to zoom in and add something else to the clip. So I'm going to add one that's a little bit more zoomed in at the end and then I'm going to add one that's a little bit more zoomed out at the start and then it will zoom in as the clip plays. Just like that. And then I'm going to drag my number four in right at the end and drag everything over. And I'm also going to add in my number three here just so I can line everything up before I add any effects. So I actually think these countdowns are a little bit fast for this video so I'm just going to double click, go to speed and slow it down. Something like that I think will just be a little bit slower. Yeah I think that works better. And then I'm going to add the same transition that I did in the first one and just make it a little bit smaller. And then I'm also going to do some keyframing to zoom into this clip as well. So now that I've got my clips and my countdowns in, as well as my transitions, I'm just going to add a little name tag for each of the cats. So I'm going to click on titles at the top and I quite like this ink title so I'm going to use it for each of them and I'll maybe change the colour as well. And to change the text I just need to double click and then I can change it right in here. And this little cat I'm going to call Tiger because I think it suits him. So now that I've added each of the titles, I'm going to add a little transition to each of those just to add a bit more animation to the video. So now that we have that done, we are left with something that looks like this which I think looks pretty good. And now I'm just gonna add in some music and maybe some cat sound effects just to tie everything together. And once you've added in your music and your sound effects, you should be left with something like this. which I think works pretty well. So for the first two examples that you've seen at the start of the video, I used the clips in between each number of the countdown, but for the last one I thought I would use all the numbers together and count down from 10 and then have something dramatic at the end. 
Because the number effects are quite dramatic, I thought that a raw get taken off would work quite well. So what I've done is I've added all of the numbers together here on the timeline, so they all play one after another. So what I'm going to do now is add a boom sound effect to each number, just to make things even more dramatic. So once you've added the sound effect to each of the numbers, you should be left with something like this. Which I think works quite well and definitely gives a dramatic feeling. And now I'm just going to add my clip at the end as well as some music and maybe a few other sound effects just to tie everything together. So now that I've added my clip in at the end, some music underneath and this little transition which I think is very appropriate, here is the final result. And I think the big metal countdown works perfectly for something like this. So now you know how to make your own animated countdown and you can pretty much use it in any type of video. As always that was only a few ways that you can use it but feel free to get as creative as you want with it. You will find the links for the pack and for Filmora 11 in the description below. So don't forget to subscribe, keep creating and we will see you in the next one.